follow-up now to a story we were the first to bring you last night. Senator Harry Coates is a Republican who opposes the illegal immigration law. Well, yesterday we reported he's outraged over someone posting private documents he believes were stolen from his office. And today he points the finger at no one in particular. These events show what a few fanatical individuals are willing to do in order to inflame fear of foreigners, especially Hispanics. Blasting supporters of 1804, Senator Harry Coates accuses someone, he does not know who, of breaking into his Senate office and stealing these documents. Should put everyone on alert up here that, uh, uh, you know, there's uh, certain activities that, that go on and uh, that your, uh, your emails and your offices are not safe. Emails and documents with the senator's personal handwritten notes are posted on the website OKPNS.com. They outline his strategy on how to postpone implementation of 1804. We called the owner of that website. He says someone anonymously sent him the documents in the mail. Much like uh, saying you found a new uh, uh, big screen TV laying beside the road and, and uh, took it home with you. And No, that's not the way it happened, I, I promise you. Police are now reviewing the videotape from the cameras set up in the hall outside Coates' office. But who does Coates think stole the documents? I don't have any reason to uh, suspect that any lawmakers here at the Capitol were involved. Uh, I, I'm not sure that some of them uh, are, are not pleased that this information is out there, but I don't think, I don't have any reason to believe that they would be involved in something like this. I would hope not. The breaking into his office that he finds objectionable um, and the breaking into our country that he apparently does not find objectionable. So uh, I suppose that there is a sense of irony there. State Rep Randy Terrell authored 1804. He says he knows nothing about the documents and believes Senator Coates is blowing this out of proportion. This entire thing strikes me as incredibly bizarre. Uh, particularly the role of victim that Senator Coates apparently uh, seems to be uh, trying to play. Well, Senator Coates says it should take about two weeks before police can examine the surveillance tape and determine who, if anyone, stole.